This is part 3 of Alberta Driving Practice Test Class 7. We will cover question and answer from Alberta Driver's Study Guide. So let's start. So we click on this alert driving test and here all the states are visible. We go to this Alberta states and now we are going to select Alberta sign test number 3. So let's start this quiz. Question number 1. Which three factors go into determining how long it takes to stop? Uh, the factors are going to determine is breaking time, reacting time, and perception time. All three options are correct. So you can select any one of them. Next one, question number two. When visibility becomes so poor that it is no longer safe to continue driving, you should, you should uh, do not attempt to drive until conditions improve. Option A and option c and option d are also correct so also check out that next one question number three never use the cruise control feature the correct answer is uh, on winding roads it's correct on wet slippery snow or icy surface it's also correct and the third one is in urban traffic all options are correct option b c and d these three are correct options next one Question number four, when you are planning to leave the highway and you miss your exit, you should, you should continue the next exit and make plans to return to your route. Option C. Next one, question number five, the vehicle for your road test must be acceptable working condition and must have, they must have signal lights. Option D is the correct option. Next one, question number six, in a traffic circle, uh, in a traffic circle, the vehicle on a right must yield to the vehicle on its left side. Option A. Next one. If your headlights fail, then if the headlights are still not on, turn your hazard lights. It's correct. Next one is turn the headlights switch on and off. And the next one is slow down and pull off the road in a safe place. Option A, option C and D are correct. Next one, question number eight. But you cannot see a vehicle in your rear and side view mirrors at is said to be uh, your, it's because it is called to be your blind spot. Option C. Next one, question number nine. Speed limits indicate, speed limits indicate the maximum speed permitted in perfect condition. Option B. Next one, question number 10. When an emergency vehicle is approaching you from any direction and is surrounding a siren, you must yield the right of the way by, by stopping until the emergency vehicle has passed and check that there is no emergency vehicles are approaching. Option A is the correct option. Next one, question number 11. When you see a yellow flashing pedestrians activated traffic lights, you must slow down your uh, speed almost 30 km per hour. Option A. Next one, question number 12. When you enter a right hand curve, you should steer slightly towards the right side of the road. Option B. Next one, question number 13. Large trucks requires Large trucks requires more time and space for starting, stopping, or turning. Option C. Next one, question number 14. If a death or injury occurs as a result of driving while impaired, the minimum lesson suspension even for a first offender will be, uh, it will be almost for 60 months. Option D. Next one. Question number 15. How many demerits points will be recorded against your license for failing to yield the right of the way to a pedestrian in a crosswalk? The correct option is 4 points. Option A. Next one. Question number 16. On multi-lane highway, slow moving traffic should travel, should travel in a traffic lane to the far right unless the left lane is required to make a left hand turn. Option B correct here. Next one, question number 17. Tourists or visitors from other countries are permitted to use valid operator in lessons for a period of for a period of three months. Next one, question number 18. 
how many demerits points will be recorded against your license for failing to remain at the scene of the accident almost seven points will be recorded against your license next one question number 19 when approaching the end of the passing lane driver in the right hand lane must must merge safely with other traffic to the left moving in the same direction option a is the correct option next one question number 20 anyone found guilty of driving with a blood alcohol concentration over 0 0.08 for the first time will be disqualified from driving and the license will be suspended for lessons will be suspended for next 12 months from the date of conviction next one question number 21 when moving from one lane to another you must you must check your blind spot and turn to the correct turn signal option a is the correct option next one question number 22 who is responsible for ensuring that all passengers under the age of 16 year are properly restrained inside a vehicle the correct answer is the driver option b next one question number 23 if you are in a funeral procession you may follow through the intersection controlled by a stop sign or a red sign without stopping you must have your headlights on or may only proceed only proceed if all of these conditions are applied next one question number 24 u-turns are not permitted in urban areas in which of the following situations uh, at an intersection controlled by the traffic lights and uh, this situation is also correct on a roadway between intersection it's also correct there a sign prohibits making a u-turn okay it's also correct so you need to select uh, option b which is all of these situations next one question number 25 when driving footage can be deadlage and it can be caused by it can be caused by for the reason is driving for long period of time option b is the correct option and guys alberta sign test number three is also complete